All right, we are going to start this off inside my living room. Well, not in the living room. It's like the sunroom when you first come in the house. It's a very small area, but my Christmas tree, I'm hoping if it will sit right here. I'll go in front of this window, but the boat is still there from last year. I had to move my box up here of my plant. I'm hoping my pepper plant will be fine because my cat was harassing it. <laughs> I like had to cover the other ones. The basil is safe up there. She can't get up there yet, but I had to cover any open spots where I have um, dirt because she was just going to town, harassing my pot. So, um, so hopefully, hopefully my pot will be safe up there now. But we are going to be putting up the tree today. Hooray! In between calls for work. sunroom sometimes gives the best light so I figured just in case you're new here um just in case you're wondering why I'm doing Christmas so early I felt like I needed to put it up early this year um Amethyst is not my only child um she's my only alive child um her sister um Avalon um passed uh at full term um, and then a few months later, I became pregnant and Amethyst was born <laughs> at the beginning of 2020. My daughter Avalon's birthday is, is Christmas Eve. So, um, I don't know. This year I felt like I needed to, I needed to have her, I needed to put that tree up early. So, I hope you're enjoying all my rare and unique <laughs> Ornaments that I find. I'm telling you, Dollar General, don't sleep on Dollar General and don't sleep on the Dollar Store because Dollar Tree be having some really cute ornaments that are like, you know, only um, African American. I think I saw an Asian one in there at one time and I was just like, wow, that's unique. So I'm telling you, if you are ever curious about where I'm getting my ornaments, they are Dollar Tree and Dollar General. Um, the Hello Kitty ones are all from my best friend who kept giving them to me every year. Um, and I have a cute one that I was just about to put up, but then I got hungry. Um, that's this one. She's really heavy. I actually got this one at um, Rite Aid myself. But my Rite Aid is about to close because, you know, they can claim bankruptcy. So, ah! Y'all know I had to get a Dunkin' Donuts one. I used to have two, actually. Um, the Dunkin' Donuts near me, I feel like, doesn't do ornaments. I'm going to check and see, because sometimes you have to look behind the register during the Christmas season to see if they have one. This one is actually for Amethyst. Um, I took everything from her, my bracelet from the hospital to even her pacifier that she had. <laughs> everything. I'm putting the globe. So if you do get see these globes, these are amazing. Um, sometimes they don't stick together well. So I do recommend like a glue or some tape. This one is Avalon. Okay, so I think I'm I got just about all my ornaments up. I don't think there's any more. But 
now it's time to do the lights. All right, so now we are working on the fireplace. I love that this has like a mantle. I found my Dunkin' Donuts one. It's going to go on this table. I had this display last year on my um, my dining room table, but this year I want to put it on um, over here in this area. I'm sorry, such bad lighting. <laughs> I know. Yes, I do play Dreamlight Bali, and they're about to drop their their big uh, showcase. Um, I know there's lots of mixed feelings about the fact that everything was supposed to be free to play, so people have been waiting to play for free, and then they announced that you're paying for it. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I knew that was going to be the case because the simple fact that they were making you do transactions when it was supposed to still be in um, development stage, which already told me, if you're trying to make me do transactions now, and you see that people are buying the stuff, um, then you're not going to make it free to play. It's, especially if it's Disney. Like, it's Disney. I know Game Loft is the people who made it, but it's Disney. No, I'm not trying to show shade at true Disney, but you know darn well. And anybody who's a fan of Disney knows darn well. They are a good company, but they are about the money. Right, so I think it actually turned out very nice. I like it. All right, and I wanted to put something in the slot, so I had some Christmas Santa signs, Jolly and Santa. And um, I'm going to get some reefs. Uh, Dollar General has some really nice ones that I want to fluff it up a little bit more. And then... I don't need any more string lights, but I might still get some. Amethyst loves using this from Love Avery for the weather in the day. Um, so she would be a whole, she'll have a whole heart attack if that wasn't sitting there when she came home. 